WYSIWYG. I've not made that up. It's one of the features that was released in Elan 8.8 .8, and it allows you to design a custom page in the configurator as if you were looking at the end user interface. In configurator v1 you would design a custom page or a media page and the components on that canvas would just show up as blocks in the configurator. On my home system in configurator v1 if I go to a custom page, so say my custom home page, we can see three formats, large landscape standard, wide and portrait. And on the main canvas are blocks. These are the components that were added to create a custom page. There's a calendar component, door lock control, lighting control, and also a video feed, but these are just blocks on the canvas. And the same goes for interface templates in media. So if I'm building an Apple TV driver and want to use an interface template, I'll only see the component blocks. So I'll go into media and go to interface templates and expand the large format. And we see the component blocks on the canvas to build the driver. If I then go to Kaleidoscape, there's an interface template of that too which has more buttons and interactions, but it's still just blocks on a screen. At the time, this was great. The ability to build pages and put custom components on a page, but we'd have to keep looking on the viewer to check how pages look. But now in 8.8, .8, we can see what we are designing in the configurator thanks to WYSIWYG, or what you see is what you get. I'll open Configurator V2 on my MacBook now, as this is one of the features that was released in 8.8 .8, is the cross-platform configurator and I'll go to my home page interface. Now we can see the page I've created as you see it on the viewer. And another cool little feature is the camera feed is in real time as well. So you'll see moving images on the camera component that you add. You can see the time count on my one. And if I go to media in V2, there isn't an interface template in the list anymore. It's been moved to the source list under a new interface. And when I click on the device in the list, you can see the thumbnail shows the interface as it would display on the viewer. You can add that in and adjust and modify it to suit the needs of the application. I'll show a couple of sources. So if I go to Kaleidoscape and show the interface, we see it in the configurator as it presents on the end user interface. What you see is what you get. WYSIWYG. Thank you very much for watching.